Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Today, we're going to do this thing. This, as you may have guessed by the title, is my swim bag. My lovely moldy swim bag. Yeah, I used to have one of the actual like Speedo backpacks that like are literally designed for swimming but that thing got rusty during the five year hiatus I took from swimming so I actually don't know what's in here so this will be a surprise for both of us okay so first off I don't know if I should start with the top compartment or the bottom compartment or the side compartment I think I'm gonna start with the top one this camera angle is not it though just just ignore all the stuff in this corner. It's fine. Okay. Doesn't smell as bad as I thought it would, honestly. Okay. So, this is what it looks like on the inside. Um, there are two main things in here. Honestly, I think that's really all that's in here. So, first... Oh my god, what was that? First, I have this, which is just a little compartment for my backup caps and goggles. So first, I have this one, which is just basic swim cap. I mean, I don't really wear it, but it's, yeah. Then I have this white one, which is kind of dirty. There's like, I don't know if you can see it on camera, but there's like a bunch of like, oh my god, is that dog here? <laughs> Ew. There's a lot of like dirt and stuff on it and it just shows like mold really easily so I don't really wear this one often. It's mostly just, I don't know, it's just there. I don't use it. Like I would use this one before I use that one, so. And then I have, oh, Blue's Aquatic Swim Cap. Miss you guys. And then I have three pairs of, what the? <laughs> I have two pairs of, Why are they broken? I have one pair of functioning goggles in there and um, two, two pairs of goggles that are missing the nose piece thing. Well, this one has it. It's just not working. Oh, okay. So this one broke. And then I think I tried to replace it with this one, but it didn't fit, and I just never put it back on there. Okay, well, I'll just... I'll deal with that later, actually. I don't really feel like putting that back up right now. Next, I have this thing, which is... Uh, where's the top end of it? Um, This is my swim gear bag, or gear swim... Wait, no, I said that right. Swim gear bag. Um, This is where the really moldy stuff is. I'm kind of... Kind of scared to open it up on camera, not gonna lie. It's okay, it's doused in chlorine every day, so it's it's sanitized, right? <laughs> okay, so first off, um, we've got, you know, basic pole buoy. It's sporty, but it's fine because it's pink. Um, this, <laughs> it's a little, it's a, it's a little moldy, but it's okay. And then, Fins, which these ones are nice because um I see I, bleh, bleh. these ones are nice because I feel super fast when I wear them because they're literally like ginormous like I have long arms and look they're like literally half of my arm so yeah I'm like zooming past everybody when I'm wearing them even though like they're literally faster than me just because I got these bad boys on and then I have these guys which are just you know basic paddles. Okay, that's low-key kind of gross. There's a scrunchie in there. And oop. I don't know how long it's been in there, but it, it's fine. <laughs> um, these... Mm, mm, mm. Oh my god, stop. That's literally so gross. These are literally so moldy. Oh my god, that's nasty. These are drag socks for those of you who don't swim. Um... <laughs> Look at it. Oh my god, stop. That's so bad. I'm... Okay, that's so disgusting. Okay, that's like 
high-key embarrassing not gonna lie how do I clean these though like I've tried I've put bleach on them and like the stuff never comes off like <laughs> okay we're just gonna put oh my god it fell off the bed bruh uh next I have some more caps and goggles these are the ones that I actually like wear to practice every day though so this is my favorite cap it's like thumbnail I didn't break them, we're good. Thumbnail. And then I have this Isle Swim Club one. This is the one I actually like where to meet some stuff because you know, it's my swim team. And then I have two pairs of shaded goggles. These I never wear anymore. They're mostly in there just for like backup in case like a pair breaks during practice or whatever. Yeah, they're kind of cheap, but it's fine. I mean, for sporty goggles, I mean, they're in good shape. And then I have my favorite pair of goggles, which are the arena ones. I have no clue which line they're from, though. I don't think they're Cobras. I think they're the one, like, right below that. It's the equivalent of, like, a Speedo Vanquisher, but, like, arena. These are the best. Like, I've had them for literally, like, a month, and the anti-fog, like, still hasn't completely worn off. They're great. Um, and last, oh, not lastly, there are two more things in here. I have a snorkel. Lastly, I have my kick, oh, wrong side. Kickboard. Best, you know, just basic kickboard. I mean, what else do you want? <laughs> and yeah, so that's all for my mesh bag. Yeah, so that's everything in that compartment. So now we'll be moving on to the compartment below it, which you can't really see because it's literally like folding in on itself. What am I even doing? <laughs> this is probably where the moldy stuff is, like, honestly, because it's just like constantly in there, you know? So first off, I have this pass. It's a Founders Park Aquatics, which is literally from like 2021. It expired a long time ago. I don't even live there anymore. Probably need to throw that away. And then I have some conditioner because chlorine. And then I have hair tie, which I don't really like these hair ties because I have like borderline curly hair, like wavy curly hair. And um, it just always like, th these are supposed to be the detangly ones, but like they always get stuck in my hair. It's literally so annoying. So I use scrunchies instead. <laughs> and oop. <laughs> um, Yes, I am the OG Visco girl. It's fine. But then we have hair brush, which I can only brush my hair when it's wet because it's wavy curly, so. And then I have two backup pairs of bathing suits in here, which this one is like, I feel like this one should be considered like literally like vintage because it's giving 90. Like, I don't know, it's gold, so it's kind of fun, but like at the same time, oh. I literally got this one like hand-me-down from one of my best friends and I yeah I don't I don't really wear it that often but it's fine yeah and then I have this one which is just I think it's sporty brand but it's another thick strap bathing suit oh my god it's literally see-through look at this okay look ah! stop that's so bad look this is okay so that was like one of the areas that like could be see-through, but like this is, is that see-through? I feel like, okay, I might not come up with see-through on camera, but it's see-through in person. So yeah. And then I have dry erase marker and some chap, oh my God. Chapstick, more chapstick. So yeah, I think that's it for today's video i think next video i'm gonna try to make one uh wait no <laughs> look at the chaos on my bed right now though anyways thank you guys so much for watching uh don't forget to hit that like button comment down below and subscribe also, let me know if there are any video ideas or any anything you guys want to see on this channel in the next few weeks because I'm about to batch some content. I think next time I'm going to show you guys uh, my bathing suit collection and... Uh
And maybe my metal collection too, if you guys would be interested. Anyway, see you guys next week. Bye! Now I have to put that all back. Mm. I hit the tripod with my fan. I have blisters on my feet right now, and these fans literally hurt so bad, I swear. Um, you guys are kind of kind of seeing the mess right now. This is a great angle. My tripod fell when I hit it with my fin. Um, but I think it showcases the chaos inside my swim bag. Great, so. Oh, thumbnail. Wait. Perfect. Um, you know what? It's actually fine that um, this happened because I need to reorganize my swim bag anyway, so it's fine. <laughs> Also, don't forget to follow my Instagram. Um, I have the name linked down below, but I think it's underscore Chloe, C-H-L-O-E, underscore corner. How do you spell corner? I don't even know. Doesn't matter. Um, go follow that. Um, I've been posting more like vloggy type content there. But yeah, also if you just want to keep up with um, me, I don't know. Social media is weird.